So we purchased this car from the second owner. He has had it since 1963. I uh, drove it through 1977 and then parked it, sitting here with the top down until early 18 when this video was taken. Um, we pushed it out of storage and recommissioned it. So you'll see in the listing uh, a pretty thorough run through of what mechanical servicing has been done. But after sitting since 1977, we went through it. Uh, that warehouse was climate controlled, so it was preserved very, very well. The car only has 27,000 original miles on it. So the 58 MGA, as I mentioned, was a bit of a garage find, Civic since 77 that we serviced. Um, but overall, really, really nice car. Uh, super dry. The one major drawback uh, was it had a paint job in the early 70s uh, that didn't age too well. Uh, over time in storage, there were a handful of things that dripped on it and caused stains. But you'll see that later in the video. Uh, so I'll, I'll first do this one slow walk around of the car. Uh, so you can get a feel for it, and then I'll do a second walk around where I'll show close-ups of all of the cosmetic blemishes. No bubbling anywhere on this car. Uh, body panels are very, very straight. You can see there the panel fitment on the driver door really isn't perfect. It's a little bit better on the passenger side. but the glass and lights are all clear and crack free. Chrome is nearly perfect and it has never been refinished. Uh, just goes to show how well, well stored the car was. The black convertible top is in really, really nice shape, um, as are the side curtains. The plastic on them is a bit discolored. Um, the car was stored since 77 actually with the top down, as you saw in the beginning of this video. The top really hasn't seen any use. Uh, the owner told us that in 55 years of ownership, he never once put the top up. It was down when he bought it and down when he last drove it. Tires should be replaced because they are still the ones from the 70s. Uh, we did the mechanical servicing but have not yet done tires. Certainly can do so if the buyer would like. So here are all the blemishes on the car. You can see some little signs, but then from storage, you'll see something that honestly looks like uh, just paint or something dripped on the car and stained it. So there are a number of these spots. There's the most prevalent one there. See some patina on the armrest. As I mentioned, you know, unrestored interior. There's a ding there on the top of the uh, driver's rear quarter. Something must have fallen on it while in storage. And then I mentioned the in the listing. I mentioned the '70s paint job being pretty sloppy. If you'll notice in the corner here, uh, they actually sprayed right over the weather stripping like trim. So while there's no dust or anything out of the paint like that, um, they, they, you know, there's quite a bit of overspray. See a couple more drip stains there. It would be an easy car for paint though, because there's really no rust to uh, be combating. You can 
see the bottom of the rocker there. It's pretty impressive. Interior is quite good. 27,000 original miles. Uh, it had one odometer up until 22,000 and then swapped out for this one at four. Uh, the original, original speedo and odometer will come with the car as well. Known history from new. Original drivetrain, recently serviced. 